Let's let them know who really got it. Came up from the bottom, now we riding in a mozzie. And these my jealous done burnt the hole in my pocket. See me, I'm shining. Yo, what's going on guys? It is your boy Bugs and we finally got our first patch in multiverses for 2023. This is patch 2.4. Let's get straight into it guys. Now it's gonna be the happy new years. Uh, we got some new content they said, double XP, okay, okay. The biggest change that I've seen so far already, new map. Um I wonder if they're gonna take out the old tree um for a map, but pretty much a lot of players, as you know did not like tree fort did not like 2v2 tree fort 1v1 was decently okay but no one liked twos and it looks like we got it right here as you can see they have a new one and it's a little bit different it's nighttime tree fort too i'm um, very curious if they're gonna keep the old tree fort still or is it gonna um be placed out for it with this one completely next we have is a scooby-doo roofless change finally um i think I, I didn't mind too much of the old roofless um, scooby-doo but i'm definitely happy it looks a little bit more different so now you can tell the part more differently um than before because they're kind of kind of the same but roofless was a little lighter i'm kind of happy they made it on the more dark side you know it just feels better and stuff so i can't wait to see how that map actually plays out in the game now or if it is just look wise but even then, it looks way better um you know uh, visually and here is the event we have is the luna um new year here you know 14 days these are items that we're gonna be getting unfortunately we don't see any skins very unfortunate we'd love to see more skins in this game and i think i think they're really just holding off for the future when the game is you know more stable and the game is actually out but then i would love to see some skins that us as players get but at the same time i don't it doesn't feel like any other skins are limited you know well some are but most of the skins you can just buy whenever and i think they should you know drop some more skins you know because it looks like you're not getting rid of them so you know drop some more but we got a cool little banner right here we have a cool ring out. i can't wait to see what this is completely because i think this is going to be my favorite it really looks amazing and then we have another ringo skin this man is going to have more skin than characters by the time all the skins come out in this game a general gameplay change Increase the knockback multiplier when when players are physically um, damaged thresholds. 115 increase multiplier by the apply hits from thing. Pretty much, you're gonna be able you're gonna be getting knocked back even more now. So that means you're gonna be dying a little bit earlier, about about five to ten percent. Uh, I was talking to some players, and a lot of players were talking about how the heavier characters. This is a big nerf to the heavier characters. But in reality, I think this is a big nerf to the lighter characters. Um, because a lot of people probably are, are saying, you know, oh, but the light characters don't get to here. But when you do get to here, now it's going to be, like, impossible for you to get to here. Because by the time you get to 150 ever, you're just dead after the next hit. While heavy characters, yeah, they get knocked back more, but they still, you know, they still DI properly and still kind of live how the light characters did and how they do right now currently. Uh, can't wait to see how that's going to um, change up um, in the gameplay now. Um, going on to our character nerfs and buffs and fixes. Aria, fix a bug where this guy's where um, if Aria stole ultimate warrior shaggy and used near it would cause a brief freeze. Oof, glad that's fixed. Next we have is air up attack. Fix the timing of the issue causing on hit cancel to be delayed by two frames. Okay, okay. Neutral attack. Added two um, frames on whiff lag. Yes, guys, this this is what I want, man. Whiff lag on moves, not not end lag. Whiff lag is when you miss. End lag is just a whole move. So it just means that they actually be punished for using a move and missing types type stuff. But if they do hit it, they can still do their combo route, still be fast and stuff. It's just on misses. But let's continue. Air side attack. Adjusted the hitbox on Aureo um, slash so that it no longer hits behind Aria as much. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I, guys, this is the biggest thing for me in this game is whiff recovery and hitboxes. Don't get me wrong. I get certain animations or how they are, but that does not mean that the active frames have to be frame one. Like, there's no reason why you should have a move that hits for a whole 180 around your body. If it starts like within her body till the size she's going for, absolutely, I get it. But there has to be a way for me to hit, to hit her. She should not be safe through the whole move and have no whiff recovery on the move. It's like, when can I punish type stuff. But I'm happy to see that has been changed. Grounded um, side attack. Increase whiff lag on jab one for four additional frames. Oh, now you're going to feel like, now you're going to see how hard he feels. <laughs> Grounded up attack. Added four frames on whiff recovery to up slash. Again, amazing. I I'm happy to see more punish windows on these characters. And yeah, let's move it on to Batman. Batman air up special. Fix the bug that will prevent clear the air from canceling into another attack on hit. Oh wow, interesting. I didn't know about that. Um, air and and grounded special on um, precision per grapple. Explosion move to the center of Batman instead of the grapple hook. Oh, I like that. I think that's way better. Explosion will now trigger Batman. Um, after 
Batman arrives at destination instead of after a fix of a deadly time. Okay, real time speed um increased to 7,500 up to up from 5k. That's a lot. Wow. Okay, can't wait to see how that plays out. But that that seems like a lot. Neutral attack increased the aerial battering startup by seven frames before the battering comes out. Wow. So that means you can't be spamming it um as neutral anymore. You gotta use it more as a like a zoning tool. Okay, I like that. I like that. Um. Grounded neutral attack, at a five frames for the start of the battery. Okay, at a four frames at end lag that can be removed with a hit. Oh, that means you can't just fly. If as soon as you throw it means you can't just fly instantly. I mean obviously four frames isn't too crazy, but at least you can't like like I said, throw it right away. And if you do get the hit, then it cancels it and then you can just go on with the combo. Okay, okay, I like it. Um grounded neutral attack, battery rank, pick up return for nine for cooldown from then. Alright. Um ground side attack, jab one, jab two can now be cancelled into a jump and hit earlier in order to allow more combo rods. Oof, so that means he has more combos. Ooh, okay. Can't, can't wait to see how that plays out. Hopefully, it's nothing too crazy, but that, that seems like something that's going to be pretty, you know, used a lot. Jab, jab into Ser, Ser, and then we'll see, we'll see what he could do. Um, Ground, down attack. Uh, Batman's ground and slide. Crime Sweeper can now combo um, into other attacks on hit instead of only his down attack too. Ooh, so he's going to be able to do... Oh, that's going to be something. All right. Black Adam. No, no, pretty much probably just explaining how, you know, how busted and stuff. It feels oppressive. Yeah, okay. Um, air up attack. Shrunk the hitbox on the arc of 25%. I'm actually happy about this. There's times where his little fingers, bro, his little tippy fingers be catching me. I'm like, bro, where where can I punish you? So, happy to see that's probably down. Hopefully that is the whole hitbox, not just like the lightning as it says, but we'll, we'll you know, keep reading. Um, grounded neutral special. Lightning surge throws trigger quicker. Oh, so this is a, a buff. So that means it's faster. Okay. Um, grab a neutral special. Reduce the length of surge minimum length by 15%. Okay, so I just can't reach further by 50% less. Okay. Lower the amount of um, shock debuff from lightning surge to one stack. Okay. Remove all damage from lightning surge throw. Oh, so you mean like throw them down? Okay. I mean, they're still going to get the ground bounce damage. That, that's just not impossible to remove unless you figured it out, but... Okay, all right, all right. Can't wait to see how that does. Um, grounded down special. Fix the issue with your protection will apply many stacks all at once. Mm -hmm. That's the bubble, but I don't get what that means, but okay. Um, grounded down special. Super bubble force um, now blocks Superman's laser. Superman laser will now explode on the surface of the force field. Ooh, okay. Um, grounded up attack. This is the main move I think everyone disliked about, you know, uh, Black Adam, which is the lightning where he has armor and stuff. So let's get into it. Increase the cooldown on the call heaven lightning bolt from 19 up from 12. Wow, so it's 19 seconds now. Okay. Added 14 frames on, of recovery of whiff. Thank you. Yes, if you missed that move, let me be able to punish you, bro. Because remember, the whole time he's doing it, frame one, he gets armor. Frame one, it's active, and it's a lightning coming now. And then after lightning comes down, you're going to try to punish him. He runs away. Now he actually could get punished for it, which is really good. Um, reduce the amount of hits from Call of the Heaven to 3, down from 4. Okay. Um, shrink the hitbox of the Call of Heaven by 25%. Okay. Oh, okay, so this is the one. This is the one for the move where the fingers hopefully won't touch anymore. Um, start up on armor apply is now delayed by two frames and now on the instant. Okay, I think that's somewhat decent. I, I think a little bit a little bit more, but maybe I could be wrong about that. <laughs> Fixed bug where back Adam's ground blast wouldn't hit um, enemies that were probably more or turn into chicken. Oh, okay, okay. Alright, Finn. Rate reduced down to 51 for 55. I'm pretty sure we already got this. That this might be a bug because I'm pretty sure he's supposed to be 49 now if you look at their WB um, old patch notes that they didn't put in here. But yeah, um... Air down attack shifted the active frames on Finn's grounded chop by two frames and adjusted the hitbox in order for a better angle of his sword animation. Guys, this is talking about his air down attack, as in like the big sword, you know? If this doesn't hit from above him anymore, I'm gonna be a happy camper. I'm gonna be a happy camper. <laughs> uh, grounded up attack delay the jump. Um, and dodge window at the start of um, start the slasher by five frames. Wow, added two width recovery frames. Wow, slasher active frame one later and n2 frame line and this change will be angle okay wow so that's the the, the sword when he throws it up okay I, I can't wait to see how that plays out if it's a little more delayed so it won't be instant in a heartbeat <laughs> um ground up attack remove the hitbox on finn's hand on low blow bro oh my god so that's the thing that he does that oh i can't wait to see how that plays out again that's another move that just be sucking you like you be you see his hand you be above it it'll just suck you back down so <laughs> Oh my god, I'm loving these changes. And it's not even like really, well, I mean, I guess it's nerfs, but in reality, it's just fixes in my opinion. Because, again, it wasn't supposed to be hitting how it was supposed to, but 
Okay, can't wait to see how that plays out. Garnet, electric groove signature perk. Um, updated electric groove to have a chance to apply ribbon before it worked a bit different. Perks, okay, address the issue where certain attacks applied shock wouldn't be affected. Okay, so it's fixed. Um, her upstretch, improved vacuum not back yet. So I didn't see the meta issue, but I don't have a problem with stuff like this. Like for example, Finn's backpack, Garnet's sting, um, Harley's up attack. I think these moves should have vac vacuum as in like if you get hit by it you should be sucked into it and be finished by the whole combo and not just randomly drop out of it. it it's kind of BS in my opinion so I'm fine with it. Um, rounded up special garnet electric zone blast applies additional stacks of shock. Ooh okay so they're buffing that. Um, garnet neutral special if a bug were stronger than your bubbles would be larger than projectiles. Okay. Uh, Grounded down attack. Show we now better accounts of disease access. Oh, okay. So it's just like like the whole fin thing where it's supposed to be more consistent. All right. Gizmo. Fix the bug where Gizmo could fall through the map. Yes, that that happened a lot. When you're knocked on, when you're attached to your ally and jump off, that happened a lot. Thank you, you guys being fixed. Harley. Ooh, we got some Harley nerfs now. You know about camping and zoning. Sorry, guys. My nose is like a little stuffy. Um, but pretty much just to stop her from camping and let's see what happens. All right, her. Air grounded side special added eight with frames lag to prank shot. Who uses this move? I'm sorry, her side special is just never that good. And yeah, it's good for movement kind of, but other than that, I don't know. I this it's useless in my opinion. Um, air ground attack fixes the issue where whacking rock cannot be blocked by projectile blocking effects. Ooh, okay, so they allow it to work now to be stopped by projectiles. Hopefully, second box don't just randomly blow up anymore, but we'll see. Um, air grounded down special increase the whacking box down to 18 from 9 so it doubled jeez and reduce the lifespan to 12 from 16 sheesh we'll see we'll see um air down attack added 21 frames of whiff lag to boxing ringer 21 bro lebron doesn't even got the bro this is a lot this is a lot i i would have been fine with like 10 15 21 is crazy we'll see what how it feels in the game but this seems like a lot, bro. There, there are so many moves that have stronger knockback and kill potential than Glove Down. Glove Down doesn't kill until like 160, 150, 160. So, oof, uh, we'll see how the, how it feels in game when it when it drops. Uh, ground up attack, just the hitbox, the head up, so it doesn't hit behind Harley as much. Okay. Ground in neutral, fix back with hammer cancel infinite. Oh, that was still in the game because when they got rid of that. Um, grounded down. Grounded down attack on hit slide will now combo into other attack six frames earlier. Oh, this might new combo route. Okay, and then grounded attack added three with frags on the slider. Okay, so again, if you miss, you get punished. That's fine. As like I said, I'm down for that for all characters. Ig, no buffs or nerfs, just a fix. Fix the bug where Ig could eat Gizmo Car. <laughs> what the hell? That's funny. Um, grounded up attack added five additional frames of commitment before Jake is able to dodge cancel out of action. Nah, it needs more. This needs like ten. This is a one. This is a one eighty degree move, and it has good knockback and good coverage. This move should should have um way more um with recovery. Oh wait, this is this is not even with recovery. This is just frames of commitment added two frames of with lag. Nah, two frames needs to be ten, maybe even fifteen. This move is literally 180 degrees. This should be, um, you know, more punishable if you miss. But we'll see how it goes. Um, LeBron, LeBron side special when L train dunk now has 16. Hallelujah! <laughs> oh my God, he actually could probably get punished when he misses his dunk. Finally, 16 frames of whiff recovery, a whiff lag. Thank you, thank you. When he when he hits, that's fine. You do whatever, you do your combos. If you miss the dunk, you should be punished. And hopefully that is enough. I don't think it will be because he literally had zero. But we'll see. We'll see. But it's crazy how this one has 16. And Harley's glove got 21. That's crazy. This move actually kills. And all right, whatever. Moving on. <laughs> Air grounded down special. Reduce the deny um, maximum maximum number of bounces before the ball is destroyed to four down to f down from five. Okay, so this means when you throw the ball and it's bouncing. Instead of it lasting for five bounces, now it's four bounces. Interesting. Um... Remove one active frame. Oh wait. Um, air side attack no ball. Remove one active frame at the end of check in order to reduce the chance of lingering occurring. Okay. Four frames on with flag added to the check. Okay. I think six and seven would have probably been it, but you know, baby steps, baby steps. Marvin, no buffs this time. Marvin, you sure? You sure you good? <laughs> All right. Marvin's face can no longer be destroyed by Wonder Woman's shield of Athena. Wow, that that kind of seems broken. 
Um, signature perks. Signature perks cannot be selected on local player. Will be saved in online. Finally, yes, there is some issues. I found out. I was gonna jokingly play him at a local. He had no signatures. I said, "What the hell?" And then, yeah, online when you play him, his his uh, main perk will just never save. I was like, "Yo, what the hell?" You gotta keep remembering to put it back on. Ooh, Morty. So when I see these, I just know it's nerfs. Currently, Morty temporary backup save is saving his allies' influence outcome matches a bit too much. We wanted to prevent situations where Morty could be save point. Yada yada yada. As we felt it was too much play. Uh, rewarding. We exchange. We give Morty some new combos. All right. Back, well, let's see how it goes. All right. His air says neutral special. Morty grenades can no longer be detonated by light projectiles. That's, that makes sense in my opinion. It should be a medium projectile, so light shouldn't destroy it. Um, air slash ground neutral special. Reduce Morty grenades to two from three. Okay, yeah. I heard people wanted him to be more of a bruiser, so they slowly stop in his um, projectile game. Um, air and ground down special. Remove healing on temporary backup call. Whoa. I mean, he can't even use it in solos anymore. I mean, there's no point unless you want a grenade or the explosion. But even then, you know, wow. Okay. Um, temporary backup cooldown no longer refreshes on respawn. Whoa. So that means when you do the move, that's the move. As in, like, say, say it's at 20 seconds and then you die, you come back. It's still on 20 seconds going downwards. Wow. Okay. I mean, hey. He deserves it. <laughs> we got we got Stripe having the whole gun situation where if I shoot a bullet and I reset my whole cooldown, so hey, I'm 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 for it. Um, air down attack. Uh, Darren assault can now cancel much earlier on hit. Oh Lord, so that means down. Um, Darren Sarah combos are coming back. Um, air down attack added one frame with recovery and one frame and like to is down. Mm, he needs more frames on miss. Increase spike downwards angle. Oh Lord. Um. Round is there, jab three of Morty hammer size reduced by 20%. Thank you. Yo, the only issue with this move I have is that it hits from above so easily. Like before, to punish it, you just jump over him and hit him. Now when you try to do that, it just sucks you and throws you. I'm just like, bro, are you serious? And then grounded down attack, increase the hitbox size by plumbus time by 10%. Okay, I would like to see that. Yeah, I definitely see more plumbus play. I usually use it as a troll, but to see him probably be more useful now is actually cool. Rain dog. Rounded side special. Increase the knockback scaling of um, flounce pounce. Oh, the thing where he goes like that. Okay, I'm, I'm happy for that. You know, it definitely felt pretty weak. Um, air up attack. Flying charm vacuum knockback. Now change the attack. Alright. I already felt like it was already like a good vacuum. Now it's being even better. Yeah, let's see how that moves. What <laughs> works. Um, Rick. Air side special. Air ground side special. Fix the bug causing the portal. Aim directly to the portal. Tends to be different depending on the direction Rick was facing. Okay. Um, grounded side, ground side attack. Adjusted the velocity of jabs three rocket based on charge time. Oh, so you could change the rocket, um, velocity based off of charge. That's cool. Um, ground down attack. Yeah, far bomb, <laughs> far bomb would now be destroyed if Rick is knocked back before. Thank you, thank you. It just needs to be be able to be disrupted. That's it. That's it. Every every projectile should be like that. If I hit you before your projectile fully comes out, it should not come out. So I'm happy to see that. Still wish it had a little less knockback, but hey, can't can't have everything, right? Stripe. Fix the bug causing stripes wind tracker badge to not work. Bro, we have so much more bugs than a badge. Please! Now nah, so there's still gonna be shadow nerfs um on stuff and like patches that probably just forgot to got put into this. So I will love to see, you know, a lot of bugs and like other character bugs be fixed, but Damn, man, I, I wish some of my bugs were, were stated, but move it on. Superman. Uh, Superman's Frost Breath was leading to really passive play. The Frost Breath does, not, uh, does too much currently. Freezes projectile, freezes enemies, slow enemies, does damage, wind boxes enemies away. We wanted to remove the wind box element to allow opponents to approach. Wow, so that means, uh, you know, when he blows the wind and it pushes you back slowly? It doesn't do that no more. Wow, okay. That's that's a big game changer for Superman. Um, air ground neutral special. Um... Superman's weight went down. He lost five weight. Wow. Okay, and he reduces wave dashing 700 to eight. Nah, that's not that bad. Only by 100. I would say like 500, 600. You would have felt it, but hey, like I said, we're taking baby steps. Um, air down special fixed a bug where eyelids would explode on the ground after hitting certain projectiles. Okay, and right here removed ice breath knockback wind box. Wow, that's crazy. I can't wait to see how Superman's complaining about that one. <laughs> Because technically it still slows you, but you know, but we'll see, we'll see. Air, grounded up special, remove the projectile trait from Dogpile in order to prevent school me from blocking it. Wow, did it do that? That's actually broken. <laughs> I'm happy that got removed. Um, grounded up attack, slams, which has now two more active frames. Okay. Dama Jerry, emote fix, 
uh, an ammo. Okay, rounded up special. Added three frames to start of the rocket before the rocket will come out, bro. This move needs less knockback. If you don't know, Tom and Jerry rocket move when he sends up, bro, it's like it kills at 70, 80 percent. Like, like what I would try. Like, you don't even like you see the knockback and you fly. No, you just you're you're like, you're like instantly like to the death zone and shit. It's actually crazy, but hey, like I said, better something than nothing, right? Velma fixes. Granted, down special, fix a bug, spread knowledge of book, with project on that hit stun. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's finally better. Yeah, I, I, I'm, that was a bug. I'm happy they fixed that for her. Uh, Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman 2, Athena Perk can no longer destroy Marvin's ship. Yeah, that's kind of wicked. <laughs> uh, air, grounded, down special, fix a bug on defense of gods that would trigger Wonder Woman's shield twice when it's hit. Oh, okay. Grounded. Oh, oh, the double armor. Yes. Yes. So, if you don't know, if you time your, your armor perfectly... You can pretty much get two armors, which was kind of stupid in my opinion. You should not get multiple armors <laughs> by doing a move like that. And then that normal down attack fix where Amazon shout V FX would not match hitbox scaling. Thank you. I would say there's sometimes where I felt like you're a little bit off and it would hit you. Bro, it's a line. I feel like wherever the line is and within the line should be a blast. It, the hitbox shouldn't be a little bit past the line in my opinion. So I'm actually happy that is being fixed. And that is your patch for 2.4 of multiverses. Comment down below what changes that you enjoy. Do you think this is a W patch, an L patch? And also, what else would you like to see nerfed or buffed or fixed in multiverses? That's it for the video, guys. If you like, if you like it, comment about anything. Like I said, comment about the patch to see what you enjoyed the most. And first time I ever watched one of my videos, don't forget to subscribe button, guys. And I'm out. Peace.